Hey yo, what is up Thrill Seekers? I am finally back here on the site of Dr. Diabolical's Cliffhanger. This is all of the stuff that happened whenever I was gone. I was on vacation, kind of. Um, I was visiting colleges over in California, so you'll probably see a couple videos from that trip coming soon because we did go to Universal Studios. Um, but here is the construction progress from when I have been gone. Whenever I left, uh, the Immelman was about halfway done. So now the ride is about almost completely done. Um, so that's kind of a, a nice comparison for you guys for, of how fast they have been moving to get this thing finished. Um, the Immelman, of course, is completely done. Um, the pathway that you guys will be entering through is probably going to be right about where those crates of whatever are. Um, that's about where the entrance is going to be. Um, so you are going to be able to get right under this huge uh, zero-g roll right over here. Um, the entire mid-course brake run is completely finished. Um, the only thing that they have not done yet are uh, just a little bit of the uh, a little bit of the airtime hill. That's it. A little bit of the airtime hill um, and the helix before the final brake run. Um, let me try to get a little bit of a better shot of that part over there. So. Uh, I guess they're doing some work over here. <laughs> um, they have taken all of the benches out of Lone Star Lil's Amphitheater, which is insane. So it seems like they're kind of doing a little bit of a refresh to this theater. They've started to paint it and everything like that. So looks really nice, actually. And right here is probably the best shot that I'm going to be able to get of the full construction progress for Dr. Diabolical's cliffhanger. All they have left you can kind of see over there um, they have already done the first little helix um, they are kind of starting to rise up into the airtime hill um, after the airtime hill there's another helix and then it goes pops up into the brake run so let me just go down the hill here so that we can really uh, see and appreciate the entire construction progress this is insane um, the level <laughs> like the, the speed at which this is going is absolutely crazy. Um, you can see that they are kind of starting to put some of the catwalks on that first turn. Um, they are starting to hook up some of the electrical components um, in terms of the proximity sensors, um, some of the control buttons over there you can see that they have started to put in, um, which is definitely a really good sign because hopefully by the time they are done with this coaster, um, hopefully they will be almost at least ready to start testing it which is awesome um, a lot of the times roller coasters will be done with construction and then it'll be like another month before they're able to test it let's see if this is any different um, just because of the speed at which they are putting in all of these electrical components um, from the looks of it it seems like they are installing track pieces during the week they're able to get a couple track pieces every day um, which is awesome and then on the weekends we have a couple electrical uh, engineers coming in to, or, or technicians, whatever their job title is, um, come in and start hooking up all of the electronic components to this ride. Um, that includes everything from uh, the buttons that us ride operators use, uh, to the lift motor, to the proximity uh, sensors that keep everything in working order and make sure to monitor all aspects of the ride. So. Overall, this ride is going in real quick. 